Hey there, welcome back to Coding Stuff. So from this tutorial, we'll be exploring Firebase database and Firebase services. And in this video, I will give you a basic introduction about Firebase database and Firebase services. So I want you to save this playlist because we'll be exploring Firebase a lot. We'll start by creating some mini projects like a login and sign up app using Firebase authentication and image uploading app uh, using Firebase storage database and many more so make sure you subscribe to the channel so firebase is easy to integrate with android because both are google's product and firebase is no sql database and it is like a firebase database is like a json big object so let me give you one example so when you want to create application like twitter instagram whatsapp facebook and many more so you want your database to be online all the time for example, in WhatsApp, if I want to send message to my friend, so as soon as I click on that send button, my friend receives the message. So that is in real time. So that is one of the service that uh, Firebase provide, real time database. So let's uh, jump to Firebase official website. So we'll open up for Google Chrome and we'll search your firebase.google.com. And here we'll click on this get started button. And here is a view documentation option so you can click on it get started for Android get started for iOS it supports web development also so for now we'll click on this get started for Android so in this documentation everything is given in detail so you can read it out so, uh, so for now we'll just close this and we'll click on this explore a demo project So these are the services that is provided by Firebase database or Firebase. So authentication, cloud fast store, real time database, storage, hosting, functions, machine learning. So we'll, we'll see each in detail and make sure you sign in with the same Gmail that you have used in your Android studio. So for now, we'll just click on this back button and we'll open our Android studio. And in here, we'll just click on this tools and we'll click on this firebase so for now we'll just click on this authentication so here are two options that is connect to connect your app to firebase add firebase authentication to an app so for now we'll just click on this connect to firebase so google chrome will pop up so we'll click on this create project and we'll leave the name as it is so login app and we'll click on continue and again we'll click on this continue and we'll select the country as India so this one and we'll click on this both checkbox and create project so it will create project for us in our fireways So it is adding all the dependencies and gradle files so we'll wait finishing up okay your your new project is ready so i'll click on continue so again we'll click on connect So your Android Studio project is connected to Firebase. So, so you can see it is connected now. So this is how we connect our Android Studio to Firebase. So we'll explore it more. Uh, so in the next video, we'll see how to authenticate user uh, using Firebase database with email and password. So make sure you subscribe to the channel and save this playlist. So thank you for watching.